I'm like, I, 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 I'm like, if you didn't feel it like that, I think you should just use that verse. You don't even have to get on it for it to, because it's me introducing no, Run the Jewel. I'm definitely getting on it. I mean, you can, but I'm just yeah. saying, I, I think, I think that that happen. verse is the perfect introduction to this is the new, darker, crazier. So I'm going to be on what, that song. What, that's <laughs> fine. There's no, there's no chance of me not going to I'm saying that's fine. However, I'm just like, let's put down that long, dope, dark ass verse to let motherfuckers know this shit is real for the next 40 minutes or so. The process of doing the album out here in the middle of nowhere is strange because there's, there's no sex clubs and drugs and violence and it's pretty peaceful and serene. And um, that's kind of not what Run the Jewels is about. It puts you away from the city it lets you get in focus, it has a pool. It has turned a Viking nomadic type lifestyle of making music into a utopian village that you would find on an Amazon basin or Africa somewhere. Um, now, now that I think about it, I better, I better hide some fucking weed. Yes. Right now. Is that all the side? Yeah, there was a lot more. He obviously took a big chunk for himself. Yeah. Um, this is fucking. Yeah, that's what it looks like of the, of the Big Bang. This is the Big Bang. Yeah. What do you think? <laughs> nah, we got it. We got well, it. I'm up for the challenge. Right. He's up for the challenge. You're gonna single hand. You're gonna you're gonna rock your baby and record. Yes. That's, that's some man shit, actually. <laughs> right. I got no ghost left but to save my mind. Let's do it again. Boy, that's a place on a lake with some acreage. I'm living, fuming, out of touch with sweatpants and funerals. I said you ride a rape van, and I meant you drive a rape van. You know, you don't know what a rape van is? Sure you do. It's a horrible nightmare of a van that trolls suburban neighborhoods for victims. Listen to it? Yeah, yeah. Just the process of going over songs, going over ideas, laying shit down, getting inspired off one another, um, constant inebriation, consistent and potentially unhealthy marijuana intake, the occasional uh, psychedelic journey and we just wrap our asses off that's what that's, that's that's what we try to do yo i have this idea for a, for a sharkisha themed hook i heard you saying that what was that i i haven't worked it out completely but i don't want to go there unless uh, like is it is that just automatically too referential yo i fuck with sharkisha I think it's dope. What's that? Like, Sharkeisha. <laughs> jump right back into the beat. Like, right, you know, right. over the middle of the shit. You can use the part of the little girl saying, no, Sharkeisha, no. <laughs> that shit. That was this shit again. Punch him in the 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 shit again. You know, you got one player who shows up to practice, who does it every day, and you got another guy who's just like, practice? Practice? But yet we somehow win championships, so I'm happy about it. Break the guy and go on the neck of a Come on and drop shit. I'm Come on, now. walking away. You said vanilla bitch that time. It's not the right word. That's just accent, bro. But no, no, it's not. But now love it. It's not but now but <laughs> Write it down. I'm telling you, just look at I'm it. I'm looking at it. But never lit. I know. And when I rap, it's no problem. But never lit. It's weird because we, I, you know, we kind of just feel like I can't remember not working with him in a sense. Not in a, just in a sense that like, you know, it's natural. Um, and the, part, the parts where it's not natural, where we had to debate with each other, argue with each other, and come up with something, a lot, a lot of times that the, those conversations end up really bearing fruit. It look cool and it sounds good, but I'm missing the details of me saying, like, I'm robbing bitches. I'm fucked up, bro. I'm out here bad. 
You know what I mean? I'm so I'm in a such a desperate place. I rock the female rap. I don't give a fuck. And that's to me a, 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 a sign of how dark this shit may go. It's just what I had in my head about what the what as an intro would would be powerful. That's all. Shit. You motherfucker, welcome to the Rocky Picture Horror Show. Anything might motherfucker happen. That's where I am with it. You know, sometimes either me and him will have an, uh, an idea that in, a, in, a, in, a, in the context of us doing our own record would never get challenged. And so we challenge each other and we end up coming up with something that's both of ours. And um, that's, that's, that's exciting to me. But, you know, Jamie is my friend. It's a brother, best friend, and collaborator, dare I say, my producer. You know, he is the Dr. Dre to my Snoop. He's an organized noise to my outcast. You know what I mean? He is what it takes to give you the killer mic you come to know and love. And um, I appreciate our working relationship, and more so, I appreciate our friendship.